And that yeah. brings me to a lovely segue, my love, that you're working with the Mr. Black Love himself, Malcolm D. Lee, of uh, the great That's director. Right. Uh, and right, you right, filmed right. the pilot at that age. So yes. talk to me about that. And and has there been any word on whether or not you guys are getting picked up? We're still we're still waiting in, in the wings to find out. We're still waiting to find out. We should know very soon. Um if we get picked up and, and like you said, like uh, being able to work with Malcolm, I told him right when I walked in and we had a phone call about it. I said, man, you know, I am a fan, you know, and at the end of the day, my mentors, the people that have always kind of spoke life into me as an actor, like you want to work with great filmmakers. At the end of the day, your aspiration should always be to tell good stories. Yes. But to work with great filmmakers, because then you don't have to, you can trust the process. Right. And and I put Malcolm on that list of great filmmakers because of the stories that he tells, the heart that he puts into it and, and how he brings the whole world together. So I already was a fan and he was a large part of me wanting to say yes to working on it at that age and being, you know, again, grateful to work on it because not only did I get to work with the brother that I look up to, but also I get to learn from him at the same time of what makes those successful love stories feel so real. Cause if you look at his filmography, you look at someone who told stories and the people happen to be black, but that's real life. Mm-hmm. Right. Yeah. And if you like, just like with resort to love, it's like this situation can occur no matter what color you are. And then you just have to adjust. So, so working with Malcolm, was just a was a learning lesson that I'm grateful for, and, and I'm happy to 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 take him away as a friend and a mentor too. You know, I add people to the list. Like I'll just kind of go <laughs> up to and be like, "Hey, man, yeah. listen, whatever happens with this project, I'm gonna need you on my on my mentor list." Right. And, and Malcolm was like, "No problem, hit me anytime." So it's good. 